Welcome to Track Star Tuesdays. This is episode three. I am G Row from Rollout Marketing and Scatterband.com. Uh, we're here with an awesome band from LA called No More Kings. Uh, they're on an Orlando label, Astonished Records. Really cool label that's local with some great things going on in the big scene. And we're going to be talking about No More Kings and their, their untitled release. It's really cool, really great album. If you guys haven't listened to it yet, I really want you to go check it out. It's on iTunes, Amazon, or go to your local indie record store and support them. We just had Record Store Day a couple weeks ago, so real great things going on there. So let's jump right into it. This is No More Kings. Let's talk about the good of what they have going on online. Um, they have a great MySpace. They have killer design, killer graphics. I love it, but what's even better is they put it into a very simple and easy to read layout and design on MySpace. Everything's easy to navigate. You can find everything. The text is easy to read. Nothing's overcrowding each other. It's really great. There's great calls to action on where to order, things like that. There's great videos, um, purchase links, things like that. It's amazing. I love the fan of the week. I think this is great. It brings the fans much closer to the band. One thing I would want to do is integrate that into the main site as well. I know everyone's not a webmaster, but let's try to integrate that into the main site. It would definitely make the fan feel even more appreciated and welcomed and feel that much closer to the band. Um, you guys own Google for the search term No More Kings, which is great. That means you guys are doing your branding, you're doing your homework. No one else is going to come along and steal the No More Kings away from you. You guys have it from your Wikipedia to the homepage to MySpace. There's a couple others you guys are seeing the screenshot right now, but I think that's great. The personal branding for No More Kings is amazing on Google. Your digital distribution is on point, and Sonish did a great job with that. Your eyes are everywhere from the iTunes, the Amazons, and other digital distribution points, and I think that's great. Um, people need to be able to find you and download your music, and you guys are on the most easily accessible sites. Um, your Facebook page is awesome. Love it. You guys are engaging in conversations. You're starting forums, threads. you got links. you got videos. It's really cool. You guys have a lot of fans, and that's uh, on Facebook, and that's really uncommon. A lot of bands have 5, 10, 20 fans. You guys are, you know, a couple hundred, and I think that's great. It's a great movement on the Facebook. Different demographic than MySpace. Um, you're looking at the college age kids and above, so I think that's a really good movement for you guys. Um, the bad, some things that I didn't really like, or just to, to my personal dislike about your online marketing. You guys are not utilizing your blog on your main site. Um, not really even sure of the purpose of the blog. Um, it hasn't been updated since early in March. So I didn't really get that, didn't like that. Although you are using your blog on your MySpace page. Your last one was about Iron Man a couple days ago. You're engaging in conversations. You know, people are leaving comments. I think that's really cool, and I think you need to bring that onto your site so you can track it. You can, you know, see the analytics, see where the people are coming from, what links they're clicking on, you know, what keywords they're searching, things like that. And that'll be really good, and it all starts with the blog back on your main page. Um... Your site's built entirely in Flash, and that's not a super bad thing because you guys already own the personal branding for that, but you are alienating some people with the 56K modems, the slower modems, so just be aware that you are alienating people like that, so maybe having an HTML version you know, that's clickable you know, for people like that would be pretty sweet. Um, you have no ads anywhere on the site. Once again, that's a personal preference. I'm all about you know, adding streams of income. And you guys don't have that on your site. So what are my two cents things that I think you guys could be doing better? Um, start using nomorekings.com in a more community style manner. Allow you know your fans to upload some photos, upload videos. You guys are going out on a really cool summer tour. So utilize the summer tour to build more comment and content and bring more people to your website. I think that will be huge um, for search engine rankings and to you know really develop your site and your personal brand. Bring them to your site. You can also track, see where they're coming from, what cities, what IP addresses are they coming from. That's really big stuff for not only you but for your label to see you know who's coming out to the shows and then how those shows are actually converting into sales, things like that. Uh, try some kind of advertising revenue, whether it's on your blog or it's on your site. It can't hurt. Try just on your blog, see what happens, you know, see how your fans adapt to it, things like that. But I think that's really cool. But that's really it. You guys did an amazing job. I love the design. Like I said, I love the graphics. Uh, no More Kings are going to be on tour all summer, so make sure you guys go check them out. Eric from Astonish is going to be their tour manager. He's the one that, you know, hooked me up with this whole, you know, scene. Love the CD. Uh, I think it's great. You guys got a lot going for you. So make sure you guys check them out. Nomorekings.com, myspace.com, slash nomorekings. I am G-Row, Rollet Marketing, Scatterband.com. This is Track Start Tuesdays. We'll see you next week.